But then when, you know, people look back in nostalgia about simpler times, there's that too. It's very romantic and exciting to look back on campfires. But you can still have a campfire. Yes. Yeah. But you, will you appreciate it when you're a super nerd, when you're connected to the grid and you have some uh, skull cap in, in place of the top of your head and it's interfacing with the inter international language that the rest of the universe now enjoys communication with people? And we're... Yeah, I'm sure. I, I think so. Uh, yeah, I like campfires. <laughs> I'm just worried. I mean, I, everyone's always scared of change, but I'm, I'm scared of this monumental change where we won't, we won't talk anymore. I mean, that thing we'll that you communicate. just communicate. Yes, but that's there's something about there's something about the beauty of the crudeness of language, where when it's done eloquently, it's 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 satisfying and it it, it, it hits us in some sort of a, a visceral way, like ah, oh, that person nailed it. I love that they nailed it. Like that it's so hard to capture a real thought and convey it in a way, in yeah. this articulate way that makes someone excited. Like you read a quote, a great quote by a wise person. It makes you excited that their mind figured something out, put the words together in a right mm -hmm. way that makes your brain pop. Like, oh, yes. Yeah. Yes. A clever compression of a concept. Yeah. And a feeling. But the fact that a human did it too. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Do you think that it'll be like electronic music? Like people won't appreciate it like they appreciate a slide guitar? <laughs> I, I like electronic music. I do too. Yeah. While well, you make it. I know you like sure. it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. I mean, I hope the future is, uh, is more fun and interesting and we should try to make that way. I hope it's more fun and interesting too. Yeah. I just, you know, I just hope we don't lose anything along the way. Yeah, we might lose a little. But well, hopefully we gain more than we lose. Yeah, that's the thing, right? Gaining more than we lose. Like yeah. something that makes us interesting is that we're so flawed. So for sure. Like, right. You know. mm. I mean, you look at uh, civilizations through the ages. Um, most of them, uh, you know, they rose and fell. Yeah. And uh, I, I do think like the globalization uh, that, that we have uh, at the sort of like the, the meme sphere uh, is uh, – there's, there's not enough isolation between countries or, or regions. Um, it's like if you get a, if there's a mind virus, that that mind virus can infect too much of the world. Uh, you know, like I, I actually sort of sympathize with the anti-globalization people because it's it's like man, we we don't ever want to, everywhere to be the same for sure. And and then we we need some kind of like mind viral immunity. Um, mm. So. That that's uh, it's a bit concerning. Mind viral immunity, meaning that once something like Neuralink gets established, the real concern is something that. I mean, you said it's Bluetooth, right? Or <laughs> sure. or some future version of yeah. that. That the idea is that something could possibly get into it, fuck it up. No, I'm talking about like uh, somebody. There's some cockeyed co concept that um, yeah, that's hap that happens right right now. Mm -hmm. You know. Well, I know this virus is in embedded chips, right? Like people have they've embedded yeah. chips and then acquired viruses. Well, when I'm talking about a mind virus, I'm talking about like a, a, a concept okay. that infects people's minds. Oh, yeah. okay. Okay. Like uh, cult thinking or yeah, some yeah. sort of fundamentalism. Yeah, just some wrong-headed idea that just yes. goes viral in, a, in an idea sense. Yeah. Mm. Well, that is that that is a problem too, right? If someone can manipulate that technology to make something appear logical or rational. Yeah, yeah. That would would that be an issue too? With this is a very have versus have not issue, right? Once this thing, if if, if this really does, I mean, initially it's going to help people with with injuries, and but you you said ultimately it could lead to this spectacular cognitive change. Yes. But the people that first get it should have a, a massive advantage over people that don't have it yet. Well, I mean, it's the kind of thing where your productivity would improve, I don't know, dramatically, maybe by a factor of 10 with it. So you could definitely just, you know, uh, I don't know, take out a loan and do it and earn earn the money back real fast. Yeah. Super, super smart. 